Welcome back to Zebra. Humans, zombies, and werewolves have learned to live together. Oh god. Not again. I was gonna do my basic video where I sit up in my room and record myself doing a reaction and talking about this, but it's like 4 in the morning right now, and I just saw this trailer drop, and I had to make something. And I would do one of those videos, but I'm not even wearing pants right now. Or underwear. Anyways, just be happy with the Spongebob drip here, because that's gonna be my little avatar for this video. Disney must have, like, an infinite budget or something, because they just keep releasing these shit Disney original films that are just never good. Even when I was a kid, I didn't like watching these. Zombies has been a flop twice, so they thought, hey, three times a charm, let's make it shitty again. And every time they drop another Zombies movie, they just add a bunch of teenagers with colored hair and shitty makeup. It doesn't even look like a real character. No one would be as scared of that. Not even a fuck infant with Asperger's. Anyways, let's get into this garbage fest attempt at another Disney original movie. The trailer starts off as any 2022 movie would. A bunch of subtitles, music that no one likes, and another set of liberal, I mean, uh, characters with colored hair. And you already know this movie's gonna go straight to streaming. I'm sorry I'm being so harsh about this if you like this kind of stuff, but I really just can't stand it. It's just a huge cash grab with shitty acting. But anyways, let's get into this. Good lord. Seabrook is a part of our pack. Forever. Oh, brother. How do they get actual actors to play in these movies is my real question. They don't, like, start cracking up out of the cringe they have to perform. Laughing. <laughs> I, I meant sobbing until they couldn't feel their eyes. Every we are going to be together forever. <laughs> Sorry about that one, guys. That little together forever line hit me pretty hard. Just got out of a relationship. Plus, I fucking hate Disney movies. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is this? What the hell is this? What? Last time outsiders swooped into Seabrook, our moonstone was stolen. They're probably here to clone me. Oh, hell no, this guy's gay for sure. To create an unstoppable cheer force. Me? <laughs> she looks like one of those kids in elementary school that pretended to be a dinosaur, and if you made fun of them, they'd try to bite you. <laughs> Oh, sweet baby Jesus, it's liberals. Martha, grab my shotgun. Why are they really here? Do you see what I'm saying, though? They dumbed it down so low for kids that they just gave them ninja hair colors. Like, they just made their hair blue. Or they made this guy's hair green. It just looks stupid. All of it looks stupid. Wonder how this one's gonna go. Maybe like the last two, where they all became friends in the end. Because they realized that having different colored hair d doesn't make a difference. All these movies are is just Disney justifying teenagers being fucking racist. We need to find their most precious thing. Our pack won't go down without a fight. Our pack won't go down without a fight, cause we're a team. We're a fucking team, bitch. Would you use an eighth grader's pronouns wrong? They're here to take what's ours. Oh my gosh, the new season of Fortnite looks epic. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed me making fun of Disney original movies. If you guys want more, let me know, I guess, or I'll just find another stupid movie they're going to be working on and make fun of that too.